late, extra late today. Um, I just had to make some last minute changes to the itinerary, if you will. Um, yeah, but I'm here. Here I am. Just working on the angles like you do. Okay. I think that's good. How are you guys doing? Happy Wednesday, right? Um, it's hump day. That means you need to drink. I'll find any reason to drink any day. Just throw it at me. You don't even need a reason. Okay, I'm here for your enablement. You're welcome. You're welcome. No need to thank me. You're welcome. <laughs> <clears throat> hold on hold on we're getting the right angles here it's important okay so what's going on what's the haps tell me what's the buzz tell me what's happening what's the buzz tell me what's happening what's i never get that what's the buzz tell me what's happening what's the buzz tell me what's happening what's the buzz? is that the right interval it's been so long since I've seen Jesus Christ Superstar. I used to have the whole thing memorized. All right. I normally would try to crop that robe out of the background, but I'm starting to feel like maybe, maybe I like it. Maybe it kind of works with the lips. So we're keeping it, it's in. Okay, who's here? Carrie Thompson is here. Carrie Thompson has some of the funniest comments. I just have to say, props to Carrie Thompson. Um, Aniaska Piaskavitz is here. T Rex is here. Liz Chambers is here. Liz, it's your birthday on Saturday, right? Cap, Cap Mlam. Kaplam, just finished watching your Jaclyn Hill makeup tutorial, died laughing. The last time I watched one of her vids, I played it at half speed. <laughs> thank you for watching and thank you for being here. There may or may not be another one of those type of videos coming soon. <gasps> Teaser. Really Real Beauty made it to a live, welcome. Yeah, so uh, people are talking about Better Off Red's vlog that just went up. Uh, she did a whole vlog about her day trip, uh, her day trip with Linda of Glitter Fallout to New York City. And we had a grand old time. Um, I already saw it, it's really fun. It's really fun. So uh, I linked it in the description box. So when you're done watching this, go watch that. I love a vlog. I, it's, it's quickly becoming like, my favorite type of video. I love seeing a slice of life. It's just strangely captivating, is it not? Hi, Susie Stevens. Okay, so this is what we're doing here today. Um, so I, I renamed the title of this video a little bit, I, A Full Face of Affordable Beauty. The focus is going to be beauty pie. And if you guys don't know what that is, well, I'm gonna tell you. Um, but I was sent um, some of their makeup by the company and I also have some of my own makeup. Uh, and I have to say the person who turned me on to Beauty Pie quite some time ago, her name is Emily. Um, I think her handle is A Very Happy Life on one of these platforms and I completely fell in love. And then I was so excited when they um, sent me some of their product um, so we're going to do this today. It's mostly beauty pie. I don't have all of their products. So there are a couple, I try, I, that's what I, kind of what I was doing beforehand. Cause I was trying to find some affordable other brands to mix in. Um, and then I'm going to be doing a sponsored video. Ah! Um, <laughs> I don't know why I did that. Um, a sponsored video with beauty pie that's going to come out next week. But I figure we give, we give like a, can I talk? 
I figure there's a little something for everyone there. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to say. Um, for whether you like a live stream or like a normal video and the video that's going to come out next week is going to feature some of their skincare as well. Ooh, ah. um, so I'm going to tell you more about Beauty Pie once we get going. But if you don't know what it is, what are you doing? Look at your life and look at your choices. So... I am drinking the same thing I drank last time. I'm so sorry for being so incredibly boring. Oh, Toss, Toss just sent a super chat. Love your Instagram posts regarding your birthday with your love. Oh, you guys need to follow Kate on the gram. Ta Toss is telling you what's up. And she's saying, hey, if you don't follow Kate the Great Beauty on the gram, well, you better do it now, okay? If you're not following me, <laughs> you're missing out because I post some fun stories. I'm just saying. Um, Lori Wilson, Kate, do you ever go somewhere special after you do your live stream with your makeup looking so fabulous? No. No. I don't know that I ever have. Um, <laughs> but you know what? It's okay. It's okay because so many people have seen me in my makeup at that point. So it's, it kind of works out. <laughs> um, yeah, so, oh, sorry. So what I'm drinking um, is just the, the Hendrix gin with the Fever Tree sparkling pink grapefruit and lime juice. Yeah. Yeah. Hi, Paul. Hi, Paula. Thank you. Um, I'm just scrolling up to see what I missed. Oh, Scar Sassar's Beauty is here. Hey, Danny. What's up, girl? Liz Chambers. Wait. Oh, Liz. Liz. Right. Did I make that up? It's going to be Liz... Sorry if I miss someone responding about that. It is going to be Liz's birthday on Saturday. Confirm, please. Confirm. Waiting for confirmation. Waiting for a go for the happy birthday song. Okay. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. I'm just making this very small and intimate this time. It's going to be just very, it's just for you, Liz. Happy birthday, dear Liz Chambers. Happy birthday to you. Just a quiet moment for Liz. That's what we went with tonight. Happy birthday, Liz. <laughs> it was drama for Lauren, Lauren Boyless. It's it's an intimate, quiet moment for, for Liz Chambers. We like to mix it up around these parts. Um, okay. Well, thank you, Toss. Okay, so I don't really do this anymore, but I do like to tell, occasionally tell you guys how you can support my channel. You could give this a thumbs up is what you could do. You can also um, subscribe. You can subscribe if you haven't. Oh, Lori Wilson just sent a super chat. Perfect timing. Thank you so much, Lori and Toss, for the super chats. You can always send a super chat. We all love a, a colorful, bright. See, there's a there's a, um, a lemon who's sending me a hug. Who doesn't like that? Um, so you can also, um, oh, Lauren is saying buy her merch. You can buy my merch, indeed you do. Um, and there's also, I've linked my, if you don't wanna donate through the YouTubes, the Super Chat, you can also uh, do Venmo or PayPal, which is located in my description box always. And the other option is, wait for it, wait. You can literally do none of those things. And that's okay too. No one's making do any of them. You can literally just sit, sit there and pick your nose and not do a damn thing and just eat bonbons, okay? 
We cool? We clear? Rebe <laughs> Rebecca just sent a $5 Zoomer chat. Thank you, Rebecca. Or, or yes. Oh, that's the other option. Wow. Lauren <laughs> is on top of it. You can also become a member of the Good Job Gang, which is my membership. Oh, Lisa. Lisa Blancet. Lisa Bobbitt. Sorry. Um, just send a super chat. No reason. Just some admiration. Lisa. Damn you. Damn you. Um, Glamma eyes. Hi, Kate. Looking fabulous. So happy. Made it to another live. It's 9.30 a.m. in Aust 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 Australia. No, I'm sorry. And I... <laughs> No one asks for it. No one wants it. And I should be working, but whatever. Thank you so much, Glenn Eyes. Um, Jessica, Kate, Kevin James Thornton, if you don't know who that is, you missed my last live stream, and I talked about him endlessly, but... You need to go and follow him on TikTok and Instagram because he's literally the funniest thing around. Uh, Kevin, she says, Kevin James Thornton has a podcast called Call Kevin. You leave a voicemail asking him a question and he answers it on the podcast. Oh, fun. I didn't know that. Would, what would you ask him besides will he be your friend, of course? Oh my God, I don't know. Now I feel, I don't know. I don't know. I'll think about it. I'm really bad at on the spot questions clearly that's a good question okay should we sorry 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 should we get going get going kind of early here um let's do it let's do it to it okay so i want to just tell you <laughs> Glitter Fallout is here. Hi, Linda. <laughs> it's true. She's she's saying um, she's making fun of me because she's saying I, I was saying I'm bad at on the spot questions. And then when when Sarah and Linda came to New York, um, we were at dinner and we were having this huge conversation about who's on your list, which. Uh, better off red is always like he's on the to do on the to do list. I think you know what I mean. I think you know, and I couldn't think of anyone. Like my mind was just a vast wasteland of I could think of no men. <laughs> I like truly the most uninteresting person ever. I don't know why I'm so bad at that. I just am. Um. Oh, not even Paul we talked about Paul Rudd, but like. Oh, I talked about Paul Rudd last time. That's right. <laughs> That's why you're bringing it up. No, no, I know you were just teasing Linda. Um, Andy Garcia. Oh, now we're, oh, see, this is, once we get going on this, we people won't stop. But I'm just going to, Robin Brennan, Andy, Andy Garcia. James Spader. Yes, that's one person I did think of at dinner. James Spader. Oh, wow. Now we're getting into it. Gals love to talk about, <laughs> about this. <laughs> Andrew McCarthy. Yes. Tom Hiddleston. Okay. See, I needed you guys around. That's really what I actually needed. Um, Jason Momoa. So many people are into that. I'm not, I'm not into that at all. Like not even 1% into that. <laughs> I don't get it. Someone explain it. I don't get it. Um, don't explain it. You don't need it. It's not going to make me get into it. <laughs> don't take me literally. Okay. Glamma eyes. I have a haircut booked for today to get the chop after your last live. I was like, yes, do it. It's only hair. Yes. Yes. Do it. We want to see it. The people want to see. Post it on the gram. 
Oh my God, Sherry Ford. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Sherry Ford, where have you been? Sherry Ford is here. Happy whatever day of the week it is. I've missed a couple lives that made me sad. My mom was in an accident. Oh. And I've been helping her after work. She's back to being a pain in the ass. <laughs> so she's getting better. Glad to be back, Sherry. I'm so sorry to hear that. I hope your mom is okay, but it sounds like she's on the mend. Oh, I'm sorry. Thank you, as always, for the donation, Sherry Godmother. You were missed. You were missed. Uh, okay. So let's, uh, let's do this thing, shall we? So, oh no, that's what I was going to tell you about. Uh, so if you don't know what beauty pie is, I literally, I'm sorry, but I am going to read uh, from my cheat sheet because I don't want to screw it up. I could try to do it organically, but I'm not going to. So beauty pie, it's not what you think. Beauty pie is the first ever membership club for beauty lovers um, where you can get luxury beauty without the luxury prices. It's the first luxury beauty product buyer's club. I'm going to explain further. Members shop for lux luxury products from the world's leading beauty labs and get access to the same luxury quality cosmetics and high performance skincare without paying for it. Does it help if I have all of these? What am I doing with my hands? Without paying for the middlemen or the retailers cost. They buy the same volumes as the mainstream luxury brands. So you get the same luxury quality, but a lot more of it. Um, so basically you, you choose a membership and then you shop up to your monthly spending limit. So I'm not going to go on and on. That's, that's a pretty good, uh, summary of what it is. I have linked everything down below in the description box at the very top of the description box. If you want to, well, you know, you can watch me put their stuff on my face and decide if you want to check it out, but here's the dealio. They gave me a code for you guys for a month free membership, which is rad as hell. Um, do that because like it's free. Um, <laughs> it's it's at the top of the description box. I also linked the website um, and you just have to use the code Kate sent me, which is also in the description box. So just want to put that out there things first because that is really awesome um robin brennan said great products i had a subscription for a year i bought so much i had to cancel after a year because i couldn't use it fast enough sounds about right um okay so let's just like get into it shall we i am going to start with are they international Ooh, I th <sighs> I'm looking, I'm looking. <laughs> okay, if someone knows the answer to that, please tell me. I thought I knew most of the answers, but apparently, <laughs> apparently not. Um, Oh, CC said they should be based in the UK. Right. That's what I thought. That's what I, thank you, CC. Um, also for all of those who, uh, oh, Stacy, Stacy Klein endorsed. So glad I made it to a live. Thank you, Stacy. And thank you for the super chat. Damn it, Janet. Thank you. Uh, they do ship to the UK. Okay, great. Um, I know I don't have my fallopian fans on right now, my neck fans, but it's actually like 75 degrees here in New York City and very, very breezy. So I'm fine today. This is great. I'm living my best life. Um, okay, so I am going to start with their, I actually wore a lot of this last night when I went out for my belated birthday dinner with Mr. Randy. Um, yeah, I wore a lot of this stuff and I, it more beautifully, which you'll see in the vlog that I put out soon. 
Um, but this is the, I started with this and I'm gonna start with this tonight, of course. This is the uh, All in Wonder Illuminating Primer in the shade Nude Glow. That's what it looks like. And I know it looks like really intense. You're like, oh, that looks like foundation, but it's not. Um, so yeah, we went out last night. Randy took me out and it was like the best. Yes, night. Oh, Anne Marie Co says, love that primer. I wear it alone. You could totally wear this alone. It's just going to, yeah, give your skin a nice dewiness. Lauren Boyla said, my nails are making her angry. Thank you, Lauren. <laughs> if I put them really close, are you angrier? Um, we had the best time. We started at uh, this place called Magic Hour, which is in Midtown. And it was like a total trip. I'm not even gonna try to explain it because, well, you'll see it eventually, but it's a rooftop bar. And it was really just, it was so like, I don't know what the word is, kind of campy and just kind of trippy. So we had cocktails there and then we went to Beauty in Essex, which guys, stop the presses, hold the phone, alert the media. When you come to New York City, if and when you come to New York City, you have to go to Beauty in Essex. This is not a new thing. I mean, this restaurant has been around. Everyone loves that restaurant, but it was like insane. Um, the the ambiance the um oh thank you ayana um it was like and it's kind of almost hidden away on this random street in the lower east side um and you walk in and it looks i don't even know it, well it looks like a pawn shop so you walk into a pawn shop and you can literally purchase anything in the pawn shop and then you go through it's like all kind of secret and then you go through a door and it's this just gorgeous expansive restaurant that's all like lush the decor is all like lush and dark and cozy it was so amazing marilyn thank you for finding me um it was incroyable i remember that from my six years of french you're welcome uh I said it right, right? And um, we just ate all the food. The food was impeccable. The cocktails were off the hook. The wine was fantastic. It was like, it was that kind of night where you're like, oh, wow, everything worked out better than I ever thought it could. And and that doesn't always happen. Let's be honest. Cece, love lushy places. Yeah, exactly. Yes, Anne Marie Co. My daughter goes there. She was telling me all about it and she said it's like an old fashioned speakeasy. That's correct. That's exactly what it's like. It's taboo. Okay. Moving on. I don't have a Beauty Pie foundation, so I'm going to use the ColourPop Pretty Fresh um, Hyaluronic Acid Tinted Moisturizer, which I feel like I'm almost running out of at this point. Um, And of course, I'm going to mix it with none other than the Fenty Body Sauce. I mean, what else did you expect? Thank you, Beyond the Skin with Michelle. Melissa Kessler, that sounds like the founder's room in the, Param in the Paramount in Long, I Long Island. Oh, nice. Total speakeasy. Yes. All right. So there's the foundation mixture. Marilyn, Marilyn. Sorry if I'm mispronouncing your name. An old, I'm an old, 
As an older woman of almost 48, I really appreciate all your advice and wearable looks. We'll be binging you on you all night. Wait, that sounded weird. <laughs> it didn't sound weird and it's much appreciated. Thank you so much, Marilyn. Marilyn, sorry. Whatever it is, I've never heard that name before and I love it, so. Michelle, Michelle Bernstein bought the sauce. It is everything you described and more. I'm so glad. Listen, I'm here to tell you now. And the minute I say this, that's when someone will write me and be like, I hate the fucking sauce. <laughs> um, just so you know, I bought the sauce and like, I hate it. <laughs> but no, everyone, everyone has written me and they love the sauce, okay? Where's my sponsorship, Venti? Where is it? I'm waiting. I'm waiting. Oh, thank you, Sharon. Okay, well, I need to put, I need to mix up more foundation because that wasn't quite enough. So the primer, I, like I said, I wore it last night um, with pretty much this combination. I wore the uh, Kevin O'Quan foundation mixed with the, the body sauce, but I can say we were out for hours and my makeup looked fantastic at the end of the night. So I can attribute that at least partially to the primer. Hello, Emily McDonald. Annalise, I may or may not have cut the collars off of some shirts, off some shirts, of some shirts, sorry, I can't read. <laughs> Have some shirts off like you listen it's the only way to go i'm here to tell you right now i just got this t-shirt and right before the live stream i just took scissors to it and threw it on <laughs> that's just what i do any advice for crepey eyelids i just can't seem to do shadow anymore <sighs> i don't i mean honestly I think less eyeshadow is better the older you get. I mean, I, I hate to, I hate to make it just a, a gloss over statement like that, but that's how I feel. Not to say that as we age, we can't wear eyeshadow. Oh my God, everyone <laughs> calm down. I can already see it. A cream shadow yeah for sure okay I think I think we're good so what I was gonna say about this primer I find is that it is illuminating but it it it's kind of the perfect Goldilocks situation because it doesn't feel I feel like it's uh it's not too dewy is what I'm trying to say you know what I mean it's just right. Okay. So now I'm going to do, what am I gonna do? Oh, right, cream blush. So this is, uh, this was sent to me by Emily months ago and I fell in love with it. This is the super cheap cream blush in the shade universal pink. Guys. Like what it's, it's well, it's universal pink. And I, I believe, I believe the title, like it's just, the perfect pink. I'm 
so good so good so this is like very it's very emollient when you when you touch your fingers to it we're gonna double blush with it don't you worry Mad, mad about it. Hello, Sandra D. It's 9.50 a.m. here. Love a morning drink. Just watching, not partaking. Sandra, I wouldn't have judged if you were partaking. I'm just saying. I wouldn't have. I'd be like, hell yeah, Sandra D. Also, your name is Sandra D. What? That's amazing. Look at me i'm sandra d you probably hate this right now you hate it people probably do that all the time lousy with virginity won't go to bed till i'm legally wed i can't oh soccer channing let's just take a moment for soccer channing thank you sandra <laughs> for making me remember that I need to watch Grease. <laughs> yes, very popular in primary school. Yeah, I bet. Ayana, guys, today I randomly stumbled upon a secret love on Netflix and wow, it's the love story of two women who were together for 70 years. Oh my God, that sounds amazing. Maybe I'll have to watch it after this. Okay, I'm putting it on the list. Thank you, Patricia Goodwin. Okay, so now I'm going to use the ColourPop No Filter Finishing Pressed Powder. trying my best to kind of just not put too much powder on my cheeks. I've spoken about this recently. Just put it where I need it. I'm enjoying that technique. I think it's the way to go. Because like that right there is pretty much perfection, you know? Oh, I forgot to do concealer. Sorry, hold please. Okay, so we'll come back to the powder. Um, <laughs> Sharon Katz. Kate, we need a Kevin James Thornton update. Anything? Should we pester him more? Yes. <laughs> no, but don't. Because also, like, I don't want him to be like, who the fuck are these people? And why are they bothering me? And who the hell is this Kate the Great person? Get, get out of here. I want to see around these parts no more. But if you want, I mean, I can't stop you. You know, I can't stop you, so. Okay. Concealer. So this is, this is brand new to me. I haven't, I haven't not, I haven't not to use this. Um, this is the Super Luminous Under Eye Genius Corrector. And I have it in the shade Light Medium. And this is giving me, uh, like, yes. You guys know one of my favorite concealers of all time is the Glossier Stretch Concealer. We'll see, but like that's, yep. I'm going super light with it. I maybe should have, well, no, it's okay. It's okay. I was like, maybe I should have mixed it a little bit with the, the sauce, but I'm into it because it's like brightening. Wow. wow. So this feels almost like a, it's light coverage, but it's a little tacky which I like, I feel like it's, 
yeah, actually, um, well, we'll see. We'll see how it wears, but let me actually look at what this, what is in this. Um, what is this called? Super luminous. Okay. I genius. So this is, um, wow. I'm like obsessed with how it's making my eyes look. It's wake up makeup for dark circles under the eyes. So it's, uh, formulated with essential fatty acids to moisturize and smooth fine lines. Lin linoleic acid and vitamin E for a delicate skin barrier repair. Um, an anti-fatiguing brightening micro pearls to instantly scatter light. Okay. Well, damn. Layer it over your eye cream and under a skin tone matching conceal. Oh, okay. For an all day long energized eye under a skin. Oh, so I see. Oh, okay. So this is like, I just put concealer over this. But do I need to though? I don't think I do. Do I? You tell me. <laughs> Guys, tell me what to do. But it looks so good on its own though. I don't need to put anything over this. I really don't. I'm making an executive decision. <laughs> oh, I don't. Yeah, I don't think you do. Yeah, no. Because if I, yeah, this is perfect. This is perfect. Um, great. I'm glad you all agree. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Beauty pie, super luminous under eye genius. Oh, so now we're going back to the powder. gonna do the under eyes here wow I'm I really feel like I'm finding some amazing light to medium coverage concealers as of late not mad not mad my friends hello Helene all right so now we're just going to quickly do the brows. I don't have a hi, Lori Abercrombie. Um, Kate, does it have a peachy tone? CC is saying, um, yeah, a little bit, a little bit of a peachy tone. Okay, now I'm going to quickly just do the Kosas Airbrow Gel because I'm boring and there's nothing better than that. So why would I use anything else? Should I zoom in a little bit more? Little zoomy zooms? Maybe. There we go. Okay. Guys, I see there are 209 people here. And there's only 119 thumbs ups. I'm gonna sing the thumbs it up song. Do I need to sing the thumbs it up song? Give it a thumbs up. I say you give it a thumbs up. Give it a thumbs up. Say I give it a thumbs up. Thumbs it up. Now, now, go, go, go. Unless you wanna see my mouth this big on your screen for the rest of this live stream. And if you do, well, you're a freak. Thumbs it up. Now, now, go, 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 go. Now, 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 now. Better, better, better. Not as good as we can do. And more, 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 more. 
Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. We can roll with that. <laughs> Susie Stevens, I have you on my TV, so just imagine. No, I'd rather not. Thank you, though, Susie. <laughs> Please, no. All right, I think we're done with the brows. Yeah, okay. Now we're gonna take a drink. Cheers. Um, now that we're, well, I don't know if we're midway, but I just, I just wanna say a couple times throughout this because people might've missed it, there is a code for a free month of beauty pie uh, in my description box. So if you like what you see, definitely make sure you do that because like it's free makeup. So um, great, great. So this is something I haven't used yet. Oh, Caroline, I went out and bought that black dress from Athleta and I absolutely love it. Thank you for showing us the clothes you wore on your vacation. Oh, I'm so glad. Guys, I, <laughs> I bought that dress in three colors and I wore it last night in white. Okay. I cannot be stopped. I will not be stopped. I like to wear a very uh, sensible potato sack but like a cute potato sack. You know what I mean? I'm into it. I'm into it. Okay. So this was sent to me by, by beauty pie. This is the one palette wonder, which this is right up my alley in, in the warm neutral shade. Um, so here's the deal with this. You've got a bronzer, you've got a blush, you've got a highlighter, and then you've got shadows down here. I mean, it's a one and done palette. Well, the <laughs> oh, wow, Kate, really? Because it's called One Palette Wonder. Okay, so I'm going to do bronzer. Let me just grab a bronzer brush. Rin, does anyone remember that I Love Lucy episode where they wear potato sacks in Paris? Oh my God, no. You know what? That is a show that I did not really ever watch. So I need to get on it. You need to get on it. Okay. We're going to use the bronzer here. Looks like it's a pretty light bronzer. So I'm not too, I don't feel like I have to be too um, careful. Marilyn, oh, oh my God, how I want all my clothes to be potato sack. Exactly. But like a chic potato sack. You know what I mean? Like I'm, you know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? You're, you're picking up what I'm putting down. Shauna at Adelman. I've been a beauty pie member for a few months and I've loved everything I purchased. That's what I've heard from literally, literally everyone. Literally. Molly Galloway, I have a question. Does blush go on first, then bronzer? Um, <laughs> I, sorry, it's not you, it's me. I'm just like, I should be able to answer that right off the spot. I just have to always think about order. It depends on what type of blush it is because not necessarily, if it's a cream blush, I like to do the cream blush on top of the foundation before the powder and then go back in and blush again afterward. If you're only using a powder blush, um, I would say do your bronzer first and then you go in with the powder blush. That's just, I, and again, you know, I don't know that I really fully believe in rules. 
Like that's how I do it, but that's not like a, a, a set in stone rule. There are no rules, but that's how I do it. Beyond the Skin with Michelle, I can't, are you a channel? Beyond the Skin with Michelle, you sound like you are. I can't get over that blush. It looks as if you're not wearing any, just a natural flushed look. Yes, thank you, agreed, agreed. Ayana, maybe you've mentioned before and I missed it, but do you plan on doing more box office beats? Yes, I do. I do, and I, I, I apologize for how long it's been since I've done one. The last one I did was a collab with Better Off Red, which is super fun. Um, it's just a matter of doing it. <laughs> they're just a little bit more, they're a lot more labor intensive than my other videos, but they're more fun. So I will definitely, I'm definitely gonna do one coming up soon. I'm going like really gradual with this bronzer. Um, this is a really, really subtle bronzer. So. I think this is good. I think I'm good. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I found you through Sarah. Oh my gosh, love her so much. Thank you for coming over from Sarah's channel. I do appreciate it. And her channel's fantastic. Fantastic. Never disappoints. Um, okay, so, great. Now I'm gonna do some eyeshadow. We're just gonna use all the shadows in here. I'm gonna start with this, which is I think it's pretty much going to match the shade of my lid. Do I have any clean brushes? That is the question. Kind of. All right. Hello, Lynette. And this does have like a handy dandy mirror too. So I'm going to go in with this lightest shadow right here. Thank you, Caroline. Okay. Yep, it's literally the shade of my lid. So that's yay for me. So this is just a matte, like super light, uh, kind of like light peachy shade yes ayana these palettes are so good to take on vacation yes i love the shortening of vacation to vacation how is the packaging the packaging is fantastic i mean i i feel like this really is like the perfect travel palette um, yeah, I don't know. You know who's really good at describing packaging? Michelle Wong. And here I am over here being like, it's fantastic. The packaging's good. It's really good. <laughs> wow. Tell me more, Kate. That's so detailed. I love that. <laughs> but it is. It's good. I don't know. I'm sticking with it. It's, it's good packaging because it is, uh, yes. It reminds me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. 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 Now I'm going to go in with the second darkest shade right here. Which is also super light. I mean, I could have like, just actually probably just gone in with this first, first of all, but Yeah, I, I think, I think to get more payoff, maybe I should have just gone in with that. But this, this right here, this smoky situation, I'm gonna, I'm gonna use my finger. 
This is what this looks like. Ooh, that's pretty. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Gorge. And honestly, this is blending in beautifully with just my finger. I'm going to zoom in a little bit because this is, I mean, it's right up my alley, but it's, it's very, it's subtle. And then I'm going to, once I, I'll go back in with a brush and just make sure it's all blended out, but I don't think I need to really, um, blend much out. <laughs> okay. So let me just swatch this so you can kind of see it better. Like this is what it looks like. There you go. And you probably get, you would definitely get more payoff if you just went in directly with that shade right there. Okay. So I'm going to just do what I do and I'm going to literally, I don't know why I'm trying not to take this all the way up to my brow bone because I just want to, because why not? Instantly eighties, right? Instantly. So now I'm going to, um, hold on a second here. I'm going to blend this out a little bit. I should have used a different brush. Oh, please. I kind of brushed some of the color away there. There we go. Okay. This better be, this, this damn brush better be clean. Okay, it's fine. And then I'm going to clean this up. Don't, don't you worry. I'm going to clean that shit up. And let me just mix up a little more foundation. we go. Just go in and clean up the edges. There. Maria top 74 has anyone ever told you you look like Jocelyn from Shit's Creek Shit's Creek's cheek sister Jocelyn Oh I don't you know what I'm not no I've never heard that I don't know who that is I'm not caught up on Shit's Creek I know don't come for me Um but thank you <laughs> I don't know but maybe thank you um, I 
Okay. There. Much better. Um. So yeah, I would say this palette is a perfect like everyday palette, like a, a day look palette for sure. Or if you're super, super basic like me, just an all the time palette. <laughs> um, oh, and there's a blush in here too. Shoot, I forgot. Okay, well, maybe we'll go back and double blush with this. Maybe, Mabes. Let me just take my powder brush, kind of go every over everything here. All right. Fine. Great. So now I'm just going to line my lash or line my uh, lash line really quick. I don't have a beauty pie. I'm just using... <laughs> Look at the nub. This is a nub. I'm using my Charlotte Tilbury pencil. It's not even sharpened. Totally forgot. It'll be fine. Uh, oh, it's definitely a compliment. It's a. It's also a great show. Yes, it is a good show. I've seen the first season of it. I think into the second season of Schitt's Creek. Uh... Just get my tired eye here. Always likes to give me trouble. Okay. Now I have a Beauty Pie mascara. So this mascara I wore last night and I love it. Um, this is the Beauty Pie Uber Volume Boost Velvet Mascara. Um, I was told by the company that this is kind of low in stock right now. I, I think it's still available. Um, but if it's not, they also said the Fan 360 Mascara. They have several different mascaras. Um, the, the Fan 360 Mascara is very similar to this. Hello, Anuj Sony. Okay. And the thing about this is that it's, it's buildable, which I love. And it really does go on like velvet, like it slips onto your lashes. Um, but I wouldn't say it's wet. It's kind of like wizardry because it's not wet. It's just slippy. Yeah, it's really nice. And they do, yes, they do. This is, so this is the black shade. This, I think it's called Super Black. Again, everything is linked down below, but they do have a brown shade, which I know for, you know, people who like redheads, um, who don't want something so intense and so sometimes severe, enjoy a brown mascara. Caroline M. Kate, do you think you'll be doing cruises again? I just booked one out of Miami for January. No. No, but enjoy your cruise. <laughs> I shouldn't say no. I'm going to say no. But I was going to say, unless they pay me 
a shit ton of money, but maybe not even then. <laughs> I probably would never do it again. Um, guys, I'm getting too old for that shit, okay? I can't live in a floating prison. It's just not, it's not the vibe I'm going for. You know what I mean? But, I, you know, actually being a passenger on a cruise can be quite lovely. Not to take away from that. Yep, 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 yep. Loving this mascara. And again, I just want to point out, wore this, how long were we out for last night? I'm trying to think. We left at 6.20 and we got home at one something. So do the math and my lashes nothing smudged nothing was out of place it was gorge this is a win okay okay thank you joanna yas Okay. <laughs> I keep saying, okay. And then I keep putting more mascara on. Go figure. What's new pussycat? Okay. Final. Okay. <laughs> um, let me just make sure I don't have, nope. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. It's not clumpy. It's not clumpy. Like it is phenomenal. <laughs> I, okay. Okay. Beauty pie. Do it to me. Hello, Pamela Willis. I'm just going to put on a little bit more of this, uh, brow gel just because I, f I, because I want to, <laughs> because I feel like with the bronzy eyeshadow, maybe my brows could be more intense. Mabes? Great. Um, should I do the bottom lashes? We'll, we'll do the bottom lashes. I've been not doing them when I've been going out, but... Okay, well, I'm gonna have to go back in with the Q-tip because I've already gotten outside the lines. I'm going to, I got a little something there, but I'm going to just let it dry and then get rid of it in a sec. Uh, hello, Heather Simpson. Oh, it has been a while. Welcome back. What next? What next? Sorry, I'm choosing, I'm choosing carefully here. Okay, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm gonna do my lips. Lips, yes, Lauren, lips. Uh, 
This is the Beauty Pie. Wait, I linked it down below. I just, some guys, this print is getting real small for me on these products. I'm getting old, getting old. This is the Future Lipstick Luxe Shine in the shade Master Sweet, which is a beautiful nude. I believe it's a peachy nude. And I have used this before. And you guys know I don't generally gravitate toward a nude. Hi, Natalie, toward a nude lip. But this is beautiful. This color. Sometimes nude lips can make me feel dead. But this is sort of like a gorgeous, shiny, caramely, pinky. Isn't that stunning? Sorry, I was like. Does it smell like something? I can't really smell anything. I feel like this is a Risa Does Makeup lip. Am I right or am I right? Or am I right? Or am I right? So shiny, so hydrating. Again, you guys know I'm not a new lip girl, but this is stunting, uh, stunning. Okay, so now we're gonna do blush, and I'm, I'm torn because I really, really wanted to double blush with. The, what should I do? Should I double blush the cream, or should I go in with the? Because I'm gonna use this again when I put out my actual video. That's going to be, you know, a little bit more thorough. Uh, well, I don't know. I think it's going to be more thorough than this live stream. <laughs> uh, but should I do this? The cream. People are saying cream. Cream. Okay. Okay. Cream. Cream. Understood. Understood. Listen, the people are going to get what they want. Oh, Educon said go with the powder. Well, <laughs> you're overruled this time. You're overruled. Going back in with Universal Pink. Um, the cream blush. I mean, look at how beautiful it looks in uh, the container. It's so pretty. So I, I do want to say this is, I mean, I hate to keep using the word Goldilocks, but I don't know what else to say because while it is balmy and dewy, and it blends like it, you can see how easily it goes on. It's just immediate. It looks perfect. Um, but it does, it doesn't dry down matte. There's a little bit of dewiness, but it does not, it's not tacky or anything like that. Like it doesn't feel super emollient on your face. Does that make sense? Yeah, not at all. Not at all. I'm going to back this up a little bit so you can kind of not see my face so big. <laughs> so I can not see my face so big. Um, oh, that really is just so... Wow, this was such a another super quick look. I just want to make sure... I feel like I'm like, did I miss something? This was so quick and easy. Uh, no. Oh, no, the highlighter. Sorry. Hi highlighter. <laughs> um, and I'm going to go back to this palette um, and use the highlight shade. See what it looks like on... It looks like it's a pretty subtle highlight. We'll find out. This brush was actually sent to me by Glitter Fallout. This is a the Moda Glow Brush, I believe. It's made for putting on highlights. So I'm ex thank you, Linda. I'm excited to try. She's talked about this many, many times on her channel. So I'm excited to try this. Ooh, that's nice. That's nice. That is a beautiful um, champagne. 
Is there any shimmer to it? Um, sorry, I'm looking at my own swatch here. No, it, there's not, it's not really, I mean, there's a tiny bit of shimmer to it, but there's not any like major, there's not like glitter or anything like that. It's very subtle. Wow. Ooh, ooh, bringing me back to a powder highlighter. It's been a hot second and I'm kind of in love. Also, why not take it up here, right? And just like blend it into my lid. Wow, so pretty. Yeah, there is, it's more like Marilyn said, I only like sheen now, not shimmer. So this highlighter, that's a good way to say it. Um, this has more of a sheen, a sheen. You can see, you can see, I guess I could get real close here. See, see, <laughs> um, great. Okay. So that is the finished look. And I mean, this is, do I even need to say it? This is just totally my jam. Um, <clears throat> I'm gonna powder a little bit here, my T-zone. These are all such wearable products. I have to say, like standouts for me that I hadn't tried this before tonight, but this uh, super luminous under eye genius corrector. Gorgeous. Like I look so rested. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, honestly, I loved everything The the, um, this cream blush clearly because I went with that, with the double blush situation, just beautiful flourished cheeks. This is a perfect one and done palette. If you're looking for a one and done palette, you know, a good travel palette. This is perfect. I already went on and about, <laughs> on, 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 on. I went on and on about the mascara. Um, really impressed with that. And this lipstick is pretty much the only nude lipstick I probably ever need. Um, so thank you so much to Beauty Pie for sending this stuff my way. And again, just want to remind you that I do have a free month, uh, a free month of, um, can I talk? Bag it up, bag it up, bag it up, bag it up, bag it up. Uh, if you look at my description box, if you use the code Kate sent me, you get a one month membership for free, for free. So definitely do that. If you haven't done that, do that. Um, I don't understand. Like I've looked at their website and I've looked at the member pricing and I, I just, it doesn't even make sense to me how these things could be so inexpensive. <laughs> so check it out for sure. I'm in love and, uh, go and also check out that, that vlog that better off red did because it's really, really fun, which I linked below. Everything I talked about is linked below. You guys are awesome. Um, what else? What else? I, I do this every Monday and Wednesday at 7 p.m. Tell your mamas, tell your sisters, tell your brothers, tell your aunts, tell, tell your uncles, tell your friends, tell your, your social, your, your internet friends, tell you, I don't know. I don't, I run out of things, but tell all, everyone. Tell everyone, come over. It's a fun time. And I will see you guys next Monday for the live stream. I'll have a video coming out this, this weekend. You guys, again, best community on the interwebs. Not gonna stop saying it. Happy birthday again to Liz Chambers. And I will see you guys on Monday. How about that? Cheers till next time. Bye.